What is a promise? Something that you come from. Okay, something you keep, right? Yeah. Now listen, I'm not asking you to think of a promise that you can make to your parents or your guardian or your teacher. I'm asking you to come up with a promise that you can make to yourself. I want to know the promise. All right? A promise to yourself. A promise to yourself. A promise to yourself. Because here's the thing. The respect for everything else is secondary. But it starts with respect for yourself. Short word. Adapt. Inadaptability. Adapt. Adapt. All right. Inability. Ability. Yep. Ability. Ooh. Ooh, the breakdown. I love it. The breakdown. So we got adapt and we got ability. And Elvin, you said what? Your ability to adapt. So look, I want you to write the write the write the number ten thousand back down here, right? Ten thousand. Look. So your ability to adapt. Ooh, God, look. That's so powerful. This is what I want to encourage you to do. It may take you nine thousand nine hundred and ninety nine tries to adapt, right? But guess what? On try 10,000, you do something revolutionary. Thomas Edison changed the planet with his 10,000 adaptations. That means he adjusted. You get out what you put in. You get out what you put in. Yeah, right. So what did Thomas Edison continue to do? Put in. Yep, he continued to put in. He continued to try. And eventually, he succeeded. You said what? You said motivational? You said you appreciated that it was motivational. And uh, Mark... Martavius, what did you say? You said you appreciated it was honest? Yeah. Okay, good. So I'd like uh, the two of you guys to come up. Go ahead and grab a donut, all right? Get a napkin and grab a donut. You said what? You felt like you were at church. You know, when I um, when I, I did an internship at the college at a radio station, and when I interned there, uh, they said, we're going to call you Pastor Blake. They said, like, the way you talk. You talk like a preacher. They said, you talk like a preacher. That's the same thing. Yep, they say you talk like a preacher. So church, that's good. Go ahead, Timmy. Just speeches, the speeches that were made were inspired. Good. Yep. Okay. Good. My man. Grab a donut. Brianna made you look at things in a different way. Okay. Good. Yep. Good answer. Thank you. All right. Grab a donut. You said you said it changed you. Ooh, that's a good answer. Who saying? Hey, how many people felt like school days kind of changed something about them? What did it change, man? What do you What do you think? Made me feel like a better person. Made you feel like a better person. Yeah. Said it truthful about what? Coming back every Thursday. Truthful about coming back every Thursday. I'm telling you, there are people in this world who follow through. There are people in this world who follow through. I proved you wrong. How so? Showed up, right? You know, one of my favorite moments was when you came to the door one day and I I called you by your first name and you looked at me like. How do you know my first name? Ella, I know your first name because you've been in the classroom all semester, but you looked at me like, this dude's not supposed to remember my first name. Come on, get out of here, man. It's your first name, bro. That's just a respect thing. I respect that you got things wrong so I can correct you. You respect that I got things wrong. So, <laughs> uh, Connie, I love you. <laughs> man, that's, that's great. Go ahead and grab a donut. Yeah, you gonna forever be in my heart. Like, Connie, I will be happy, happy to debate you any place, anytime, anywhere, all right? And we will respectfully disagree with one another. Because <laughs> that's what we do. I want you guys to remember this one more time and to tell you. There are people in this world who follow through. There are people who show up. There are people who make a promise and they keep their promise. I don't want you to think that's everybody. There are people in this world who will let you down. And some of you maybe have already experienced that. But there are people who will show up, there are people who will make promises, and there are people who will follow through, okay? So next time that that doubt crosses your mind, I want you to remember this program, this, this School Days Thursday that we did when I made the promise to you guys at the beginning of the semester that I'd be here, and by the end of the semester, I was still here, still showing up, still following through, because that's what you do to put yourself in a position to win. That's what successful people do. And that's something that every one of you are capable of doing. So show up and follow through. Because you get out what you... Fam, I love you guys.